Hi guys, this is Sawi from Solfix. Today, we got something special to unbox. So, let's check it out. Hi guys. So, ano nga pala tong bubuksan natin ngayon? So, ito siya. Nabasa nyo, this is the Jordan 11 Retro IE. And the usual um, OG box to. Yeah. Hindi siya yung typical na Jordan 11 box kasi um, when this was released back in 1996, hindi pa Jordan brand talaga yung Jordan na alam natin ngayon. So, it is just a subsidiary of a uh, Nike which is um, on the Jordan 13 na lang sila nagkaroon ng sariling box na Jordan brand talaga. Ayun. So, a little bit history and this is the Jordan 11 Retro IE. Ayan. Based on the description from the Nike website, this is the truest to the OG color and form. Um, this sneaker is the first low edition of the Jordan 11. Hindi ito yung original na low version ng Jordan 11. These are the very first low edition ng Jordan 11. So, so we all know that the patent leather version of the Jordan 11 is yung pinaka sikat or mas widely known for the Jordan 11 but a brief history um, during the 1996 season which is the 72 10 um, season of the Chicago Bulls Michael Jordan is known for wearing the bread um, Jordan 11 and then the Concords but in between those some um, games he wore this um, sneaker. I think maraming beses niyang sinuot to. Uh, the only thing that I know why he stopped wearing this is because he got injured. And, and then he went back to wearing his, the OG form of the Jordan 11. But for the um, collectors out there and OG sneaker heads like me, this is a must have and this is a sought after colorway because this is the truest to the OG. I'll post the pictures where Michael Jordan wore this in the game. So let's talk about what makes this different from the Jordan 11 low na alam natin. Meron ako dito nung Jordan 11 Jubilee. So gan alas ganito itsura nung, nung Concords tsaka nung bread na usually so ni Jordan during that season. So ayan siya. Ito yung difference niya. Ayan. Makikita nyo. Ayan. In terms of uh, comparing this to the usual uh, Jordan 11 low na alam natin. Ayan. Kitang kita nyo talaga yung difference niya. Because it doesn't have the, the patent leather. And iba yung itsura ng pagka upper niya. So this one, for some lows na Jordan 11, it has leather on its upper and then the patent leather. And also the lacing system is different. Yeah, but in terms of um, the um, midsole and the outsole, it is very, very similar same technology it has the phylon midsole and encapsulated in it is the nike air yeah. and also the the jordan 11 is known for the herringbone traction pads so let's talk about this now so it's all upper nya is smooth leather ayan so amoy na amoy nyo na leather talaga siya, including the tongue but instead of the patent leather this has the um, suede. Ayan. Makikita nyo yan. Suede yan. Tapos ito is mesh. Which you can see right through your socks. So, may breathability itong sneakers na to. 
So I think that's one advantage of this sneaker compared to the Jordan 11 lows na alam natin kasi much breathable to. So and si Jordan 11 is known for the first version of the fast lacing um, technology. Katulad nito. Yan, hindi siya yung regular lacing. But dito kay Jordan 11 IE, you got two ways to do to lace this up. So as you can see, I used the fast lacing way and instead na ano na si ano lace through. So yung traditional lace through um, version pwede nyo ring gawin ayan. Kitang kita niya. So yeah. So there's two ways the fast lacing and then the lace through yeah. or yung traditional lacing ayan. two ways and so then, nasa sa inyo yun kung anong gusto nyo yung style ng lacing kung gusto nyo yung traditional na lace through or yung fast lacing na Jordan 11 style ayan, ganito ayan so, so the upper is um, all leather and then the insides the linings are neoprene Ayan. and also this includes the polyurethane um, insoles because this is a 25th anniversary version in this form truest to the OG form and um, let's talk about the fit this fits true to size but I felt that this is a bit longer compared to my Jordan 11s because uh, the Jordan 11 has a cushioning banda sa may toe box and then sa may bandang upper but this one uh, less yung cushioning niya somewhere in the toe box and this is a bit pointy compared to the Jordan 11 in toe box medyo pointy itong Jordan 11 IE but in terms of fit uh, you go two to size kapag um, wide footers kayo go half size big pwede na kasi nga kung true to size kayo medyo may space pa somewhere right here right here um, in terms of um, comfort this has the same feeling as the Jordan 11 low that I have but the thing that I noticed is that my legend blue is much softer yung yung cushioning niya compared dito ito din sobrang lambot din itong jubilee so dito sa IE medyo may katigasan yung ginamit na foam but not that uncomfortable still soft but not as soft as this um, 2 Jordan 11 in terms of comfort naman, this is breathable. Masyado siyang press kong suotin. So, kung pa casual, sarap gamitin ito. And in terms of availability, um, um, this, hindi masyadong na pumatok. Kasi nga, yung mga original sneakerheads lang yung medyo may gusto nito. So, this is still widely available in Titan and in Nike Park and in Jordan Manila so you can check this out go this. online and go in stores but may mga appointment so ayan so mga collectors this is a must have sa mga Michael Jordan fans this is also a must have so I think that's all I can say about this sneaker so if you're new to our channel please subscribe to our YouTube channel and check our um, social media which i will post at the end of the video and uh, we're, we already have 102 subscribers to our youtube channel for our ig we still need at least two to have the 100 um, subscriber and for the facebook channel we have 423 so keep on supporting us and um, share like and um, spread um, the word about our channel uh, our only goal here is to give you knowledge about the sneakers and encourage you that uh, 
being a sneaker de- head is uh, fun. So this is how we sold picks out and keep moving forward.